Hi everyone. A few weeks ago I shared some pictures from a train journey up to Zaragoza in the north of Spain. In between the beautiful green and gold landscapes, I included just a few from the wedding I was travelling to, and now's my chance to tell the story of my first Spanish wedding. Here I was using two Fuji X-T4s with the original 23 1.4, 35 1.4 and the 56. I had wanted to photograph a wedding in Spain for so long. The bride here is the cousin of a friend of mine who is a fantastic wedding photographer. As she wanted to enjoy the day with her family rather than have to concentrate on pictures, she put me in touch with the couple. We both photographed the morning and the ceremony together, and then I took over when the fiesta started. Photographing weddings in different countries is one of my favorite things to do, and one of the best parts of being a wedding photographer. If you're visiting a new city and you don't know anyone there, you can naturally feel on the outside of everyday life. But as a wedding photographer, you have the wonderful experience of arriving somewhere brand new and suddenly being at the heart of life there for a day. Of course, being at a wedding doesn't give you a view on everyday life, but it's still real life and packed with characters, traditions, music and dancing. In the morning, the bride and groom were getting ready in a hotel overlooking their spectacular venue, the Cathedral Basilica of Our Lady of the Pillar. It's reported to be the site of the first ever chapel dedicated to Mary and has an amazing history dating back to her lifetime. The Spanish seem to have been into Mary and her son pretty early on. If Christianity was a rock band, the Spanish could certainly boast that they were into them way before they got big and started playing stadiums. Photographing the wedding was fun and challenging. First, as they say, there was the light. This was a bright, bare Spanish sun that I was always trying to keep behind or simply away from my subjects. It wasn't easy, but I wouldn't have wanted to photograph my first Spanish wedding on a cloudy day. The second challenge was the language barrier. Despite the couple speaking some English and my Spanish friend speaking superb English, there was still sometimes a gap or delay in being able to communicate with the couple or guests but we got by. It was quite funny though, while posing them by the river near the cathedral, I explained to them that I'd use only simple English words that I knew they'd understand. Basically anything from Beatles songs. I want you to hold your hands, come together, you get the idea. But more than any other memory I have of the day was just how friendly everyone was to me. As my friend had predicted, Everyone's proficiency in English increased dramatically after a few drinks. My limited Spanish, though, is beyond the help of alcohol, but it did inspire me to try and work on that in the future. Let me know in the comments what the Spanish is for. Like and subscribe. Hasta luego.